think of animals that live in the snow and on the ice, probably the first two we think of are polar bears and penguins. Although both of these animals are polar, you'll never find them on the same pole together. Polar bears live in the Arctic, which is the North Pole, as well as parts of Canada, Alaska, Russia, Greenland and Norway. Penguins only live in the Southern Hemisphere. Most penguins live in Antarctica, but you can also find penguins living in the wild in Australia, Argentina, South Africa, the Falkland Islands and the Galapagos Islands. Polar bears are the largest bears in the world. In fact, they are the largest living carnivores that live on land. An adult polar bear can measure over 2.5 metres long and weigh just under 700 kilograms. Polar bears appear to be white, but they actually have black skin which helps them soak up rays from the sun to keep warm, and their fur isn't actually white. A polar bear's fur is actually transparent with a hollow core that reflects light. This helps the polar bears blend in to their surroundings. Despite being huge creatures, polar bears are excellent swimmers. They can easily swim at 10 kilometers an hour and have been found swimming in the Arctic Ocean more than 100 kilometers from the shore. Polar bears use their great sense of smell when hunting seals and other prey. They can smell things from up to 16 kilometers away. Even though they can smell their prey from miles away, polar bears are not very successful at getting their food. They only catch something on average once in every 50 attempts. There are 18 species of penguins and half of them live on the coast of Antarctica and Antarctic islands. Although penguins are birds, they cannot fly and they don't have wings, they are flippers. Penguins are easy to recognise due to their black and white fur. The reason for the colouring is that when they are in the oceans, their predators cannot identify them from the sky above. Their white bellies blend in with the ice and their black fur acts as camouflage. While all penguins may look similar, they have their own unique voice. Scientists believe that this helps them identify their mates in large crowds. Penguins come in all shapes and sizes. The largest penguin are the emperor penguins and they can weigh 80 pounds. Emperor penguins are only one of two types of penguin that spend their whole life on Antarctica. The smallest penguins are the fairy penguins, also called little blues, and they can be found in Australia and New Zealand. These penguins weigh as little as one kilogram, which is the same as a bag of sugar. Penguins are also excellent swimmers, with possibly the emperor penguin being the best. These penguins can dive underwater down to 500 metres, but that is deeper than how tall the Empire State Building is. Both polar bears and penguins are more curious of humans than afraid because they are not hunted by us. 
The biggest threat to these animals is climate change, global warming. The Arctic is warming about twice as fast as the global average, causing the ice to melt, which means their main prey, seals, cannot raise their pups. The same problem applies to penguins, particularly the emperor penguins. Emperor penguins rely on the sea ice to form their breeding colonies, avoid predators and forage for food. Because of global warming, emperor penguins may go extinct in the wild within the next 30 to 40 years and polar bears could be extinct by the year 2050.